How did this happen? How did this happen again? Back to fucking square one. You know, normally I'd like to call it square two, three, or even four. But no, at this very moment, on this particular day, the 11th of March, 2024, I am indeed back to square one. I have just completed my latest relapse. I say completed because today is a day that I will remain sober. Um, I've just completed a 38-day relapse. <laughs> Normally you say completed a 38-day like rehab or... Uh, yeah, no, in this case it's a relapse, um, well and truly. Uh, it wasn't a lapse. A lapse is maybe a week tops. A couple of days would be good, but it began as a lapse and what I thought would be a lapse or an experiment. And unfortunately, that experiment landed me in the grips of alcohol addiction once again. So I am pretty confused at this point. I'm confused as to how the fuck I let that happen after being on such a good trajectory throughout the month of January, which you're still yet to see on this channel. I'm also confused as to why I, I am making these videos and if I can continue to make them and, and if I do, what will be my approach because I cannot continue to speak with the utmost conviction about remaining sober for these reasons, you know, it, this is the, these are the benefits and, and this is how I'm going to do it and I, I feel so good and everything's going good, you know, life's on easy mode. Fuck, there's a video not too long ago, a couple months ago, where I, I literally said life was on easy mode and it was, but you know, there have been stresses of life that have come up since then and I just have not had the tools to cope with them without bringing alcohol back in. Now, alcohol, it puts me in a certain mood where I can just brush away anything negative and just focus on the present. That's what it does for me. It allows me to be in the present moment and not worry about you know mistakes I've made in the past and, and things I've got to worry about in the future, which is depression, which is the past, and anxiety, which is the future. So I'm confused about as um, you know, whether I do want to continue this channel or whether I can, whether I can actually you know, remain credible in this space, which is something I, I do want, something I thought I wanted. You know, I, I started this channel a year, a, a year and two months ago now, and at that point I was t totally desperate. Um, it wasn't a 38 day relapse, it was a fucking year at that point. You know, I'd, I'd given it my best shot to remain sober um, but I just couldn't do it myself and I didn't have anyone to talk to about it So I began making these videos and forgive me. I am sweating. It is extremely hot in this house Okay, so I've got to go and pick up my my youngest daughter from school um, For those wondering if I did indeed go to Thailand. I don't want to spoil you know and I Well, you know, I'm literally I'm, I'm two months behind as far as chronologically from today's date with the videos I'm, I'm publishing at the moment. That pisses me off, but that's just the way that it ended up happening. And so I did talk about going to Thailand for particular reasons, and I did go to Thailand, and I did have all the best of intentions of going over there sober and reaping all of the benefits of, uh, you know, a, a laid back, um, tropical, uh, cheap lifestyle for at least a couple of weeks if not a month and unfortunately my relapse uh, took hold and it took away any ability for me to uh, re re you know reap any benefits from that trip I did go on the trip I did cut it short I'm back in Alice Springs now and I feel good about that but you know this journey starts again I'm back to fucking square one once again I can't believe it I'm so fucking disappointed man and now I don't have alcohol to remove that disappointment I've just got to fucking face it head on you know I've got bills I need to pay I don't have that full-time job anymore I fucking quit should I have done it well you know I've gone back and forth on that and yes I do believe I still should have done it it wasn't for me um, I'm gonna be picking up some shifts for my second job and I've got a couple of applications in for another full-time job so fingers crossed I get something soon because you know an idle an idle mind, an idle life is, is the devil's workshop and for me to not be working I've come to terms with the fact that that is just not it's, not, it's not financially viable and it's not viable for me to have any, any hope of remaining sober. So 
I just wanted to update you guys, the date is the 11th of March. Continue, you know, watching these videos that come out, the counting calories ones, the, um, the, the quitting alcohol of course, and just updates on the smoking weed and the, and the porn and, and such. Um, I will continue creating content, I just don't know what format. I have decided to stop the daily uh, vlogs, the daily, um, you know, di diary entries. So you won't be seeing any more of those after about day 130, but you know, I have created a few videos like over the last 38 days where it's my last drink, you know what I mean? And I'm, I'm so confident of it. So I pull out the camera and I, I, I literally video myself having my last drink. And then the next day I wake up and I make a, a day one video and I might get through, I don't know, through to the afternoon. And by that point, you know, that the physical effects of the hangover have, have worn off and I'm, I'm back on the bandwagon, you know, and I'm just like, fuck, how? How does that happen? It's just, it's my coping mechanism. It is my comfort zone. It's what I go back to. And uh, I've got to get into that mindset where I've got more in life, but you know, my life is worth more. The positive things in my life are worth more than that drink. And I've been there not too long ago and I'm gonna get back there and it starts right now. So thank you for watching as always. I've got to pick up my daughter now, which I can't wait for, it's gonna be great. Although my anxiety says otherwise, but you've just got to grin and bear it and it is what it is. So that's where I'm at guys, and I'll see you when I see you. <sighs> thank you for the support, man. But like I said, I don't know if I can continue making these videos. I don't know if I want to continue making these videos, but I had to make this one. Cheers.